Welcome to Figure Feedback. My name is Jeremy and coming hot on the heels of that potential leak of the Creality K2 Plus comes a couple new teases from Elegoo and Anycubic. So let's take a look at what they are teasing right now, starting with Anycubic. Over on their Instagram page, they posted something a few days ago, actually. This is one of those blinking, you would have missed it kind of things. But they say, Anycubic prints a rainbow. Transform your creations from nice to big wow. Stay tuned. And here is the only picture that they have of it. Now, what do you think this could possibly be? Well, it definitely, to me, looks like some type of multi-material system, some sort of multi-color printing system. They've got some green, purple, blue, and orange filament and a rectangular size box with a clear lid on it. So it seems to me that Anycubic is teasing the eventual full reveal and release of a Bamboo Lab AMS competitor. And it's about darn time. But that's not it, because if we look a little bit closer at this photo, enhance and just zoom in, we see that there's something else in there. You see how the back of that cloth, there's something that's tall. And then if we look down at the bottom left, there's a number three on the bottom of whatever that is. Now, what could that be? Could it possibly be the Cobra 3? Is this gonna be a new printer that they have? And what kind of printer is it? Is it gonna be the standard bed slinger or are they gonna go the core XY route that so many other companies are stepping into the modern times and developing a printer just like that? We don't know yet and we don't know when the full reveal is going to be, but they've definitely caught my interest with this. Now, of course, with a new system like that, the question is going to be, is it going to be backwards compatible with the things that they already have now? Absolutely no idea. But if you were thinking about buying an Anycubic FDM printer, you might want to just hold out for a little bit longer to see what this is all about. And before I step away from this, I mean, it's not like Anycubic is trying to hide this. I mean, look at what they're saying here. Are we stepping into a new era of 3D printing? Imagine a world where your creations come to life in vibrant colors. Is Anycubic about to unveil a multicolor 3D printing breakthrough? Now, why would they even say this if this was something that they weren't actually going to do? But we need more information. I can't wait to see what is in store from Anycubic on this front. Next up, let's see what Elegoo is teasing. So here is a video that Elegoo has put out. It's a very dark, somewhat moody short video showing some parts of a new printer that they say is coming soon with little to no other indications of what it might be based on just this video here. But we're just taking a look at it. We've got a bit of some black and some green going on. Whatever could it be? Well, at the risk of spoiling the surprise, it does appear that this particular printer has already been leaked uh, at least a couple of months ago from our good friends over at the FCC. So unless this is a total swerve, this printer is going to be called the Saturn IV Ultra. And here is a post on Reddit from a couple of months ago with a link to the FCC submission source that has some documentation for the Elegoo Saturn IV Ultra. Now the Saturn IV Ultra is a resin based 3D printer and based off this artwork, it certainly does look like those teaser images and color that we just looked at. We even got a packing list here. It's gonna have a Wi-Fi antenna, there's the build platform, the resin tank, an AI camera, possibly to monitor for potential failures. That's always good to have. Resin tray, USB flash disc, a mask, which honestly, you know, Real quick, when it comes to resin 3D printing, I'm a big proponent of being safe when it comes to this kind of stuff. And the mask that they give for uh, resin 3D printing, they're not appropriate. You need a respirator for resin 3D printing because the, the regular face mask, that's not gonna be good enough. You need something that's gonna filter out those fumes. But you're also gonna get some gloves, which is very important. A funnel, which is most likely going to be some paper, backup screws, a manual, an adapter of some kind. I'm not sure if that's going to be a toolkit and a scraper. And here's some other information, technical information about the printer, touchscreen, screw knobs, build plates, handles, you know, it is a resin 3D printer. 
So it definitely does seem like we are in the midst of a 3D printer refresh from these three companies, Anycubic Reality, as well as Elegoo. And uh, I'm just still really curious to see what kind of features these printers are going to have, especially what Anycubic is doing with that multicolor printing system that they have cooked up, as well as this Saturn IV Ultra 3D printer and what that is capable of on the resin front. And um, I'm gonna keep my eyes open to see if there's gonna be any more surprises from any of these other companies. Surely it cannot be a coincidence that they are all coming out at the same time with teasers about upcoming releases. So yeah, get those wallets ready if you are looking to buy your first or upgrade your existing 3D printers because there's some right around the corner. I'm going to keep my eyes open for any more news and teases about new products that's going to be coming up. And if I find some, I'll be sure to let you know about it. But until then, thanks for watching. Take care of yourselves and I'll speak to you soon.